Oh, that smell. Benny here, GhostFixATS.com, the number one sports consultant in the business. Friday, June 19th, Juneteenth, Freedom Day. Much love. Just hopping in here today to say what's up. Bing, bang, boom. I already hit my recap uh, yesterday or Wednesday for this past Saturday. Broom is still in the building, by the way, because the last thing I did in sports betting was swept. So Broom is still here. So coming right back at it this Saturday for UFC Fight Night, Blades versus Volkov. Y'all realize who's fighting, right? Right? Remember way, 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 way back when Conor McGregor fought Khabib? Remember that? Well, if you've been with me since the beginning or since that time, you may remember the night that McGregor fought could be. It's a night that I will never, ever, ever forget. And I'm not here to brag and I'm not here to boast. It was a terrible night for the Ben dog. <laughs> it was terrible. It was, it was all because of Derek, my balls is hot, Lewis. You know who I'm talking about. Derek, my balls is hot, Lewis. We're going back to the fight where Derek Lewis, Derek, my balls is hot, Lewis, said... My balls is hot. After he got his butt kicked all around the octagon until the very end of the fight when he threw a punch and knocked his opponent out. Do you remember who that opponent was? Alexander Volkov. You know who was on Alexander Volkov for a lot of money in that fight? Way, 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 way back. Benny. It was awful. Sucked the wind right out of me. As a matter of fact, that fight and that loss was a turning point in that whole event for me. I got crushed. My clients were mad. It sucked. You know, I come up here and I talk about these sweeps and how well I'm doing and, you know, when I'm doing well. Uh, but let's get real. It's not always peaches and cream. It's not always rainbows and butterflies. That was awful. It rattled my brain. It rattled my cage for like a week. It was an awful loss. Volkov beat Lewis the entire night. He beat, he beat, them, beat Lewis around the entire fight. Dominated him. Then he got knocked out. He got caught. And he got knocked out in the final seconds of the entire fight. And there was a momentum swing. I lost huge on McGregor that night as well. But anyway, why am I telling you this? Redemption. UFC fight night. Alexander Volkov is fighting in the main event of this UFC event. Curtis Blades versus Alexander Volkov. You best believe I'm ready to pound it on Saturday. I'm on a roll in UFC. This entire pandemic, I'm on a roll. 4-0 this last time McGregor fought Cowboy right before the pandemic. That was a sweep. 3-1 the fight after that. Then we had a winning 2-2. A 3-1. A winning 2-2. 4-0. Another sweep. We went 2-2 after that. Then I had a losing 2-2 where we lost some juice. It was close. And then 4-0 uh, on this last event. Broom is in the building. So I've been balling. That's all profit Just despite the, the one losing 2-2. The hits are nice. Those 4-0s are, are, are substantial gains for me and my clients. I fully expect to deliver again. I've now hit my last three or four plus money parlays. I've uh, been super solid on those parlays. And they're very exciting, right? You hit that first leg, boom. You hit that second leg, boom. And then you hit that third leg and it's ching, ching, money in the bank. And honestly, my goal in the UFC is, you know, to narrow down the card to what I feel are the smartest bets in order for us to make money. Keep it simple and just keep cashing in. UFC fight night, Curtis Blades versus Alexander Volkov, no different. The UFC package is listed in the description of this video. It's 30 bucks. Uh, Roosevelt Roberts is back in the octagon for us already. He just fought it two, two weeks ago, I believe, and it ended really quick. So he's back already. I love that guy, man. I really, really do. Josh Emmett versus Shane Burgess. Uh, 
Raquel Pennington. It's another stacked event. And that, that is that. Gear up. Get linked up. 30 bucks in the description of this video. Soccer fans, English Premier League is back as well. English Premier League is something I really enjoy betting on. I've always capped it. Uh, but I've never had a demand for it here at Ghost Picks. I really haven't. Uh, very few people want wanted soccer. You know, I started out as a soccer capper coming into this Ghost Picks thing. I mean, that's what I thought I was going to do, and that's what I enjoyed doing. Uh, even though I love all these other sports, and I've always done all these other sports as well, soccer, I, I had planned every intention on doing soccer. wasn't a demand for it with all the other sports. We had the, you know, and everybody wanted MLB, NFL, NBA, college sports. And that's what I I enjoy. Like they're my favorite too. So anyway, but uh I've always bet EPL. And I do have a few clients who have asked for it in the past and I put it in their package and we do it. So uh well it's back. There aren't any other sports, so if you want it, I got it. I'm not doing like a season or anything like that. I'm combining it with UFC this weekend. So if you want UFC and EPL is $49.99, and you get UFC and soccer this weekend. It's in the description of this video, and then I have the Benny fully loaded. Uh, actually, it's the Benny half loaded, because I cut the price in half. Uh, every time I look, they're canceling things or shortening seasons, so it's whatever. It's NBA. You're going to get the full season of NBA. You're going to get the full season of Major League Baseball, however long that may be. You're going to get UFC up until the NBA starts, and you're going to get EPL up until the NBA starts, English Premier League. So it's 400 bucks. It's in the description of this video, and that's it, guys and gals. We are seeing things creeping up. Sports are right around the corner, and one day at a time, we are getting there. It's not easy. You know, hopefully we don't have any setbacks, not only in sports, but in life. You know, but let's keep pushing forward. Let's profit where we can and do what we love to do. It's what we're here for, to bet sports. I stick to what I do, UFC and soccer for now. And then we have NBA and Major League Baseball right around the corner. I love you guys. Thanks for tuning in. Black Lives Matter. And as always, good luck. God bless. Grand on, baby. Cheers.